Welcome. To create a pivot table. Introduction to pivot tables. In this you will learn about pivot tables. When you have a lot of data, it can sometimes be difficult to analyze all of the information in your worksheet. Pivot tables can help make your worksheets more manageable by summarizing your data and allowing you to manipulate it in different ways. Select the table or cells, including column headers, you want to include in your pivot table. Under the ribbon, click on Insert tab to use a pivot tables for calculating and summarizing the data in a way that will make it much easier to read. From the Insert tab, click on Pivot Table command and a dialog box will appear. It will easily arrange and summarize complex data in a pivot table. The Create Pivot Table dialog box will appear. Choose your settings, then click OK. In our example, we will use Table 1 as our source data and place the pivot table on a new worksheet. A new worksheet created. A blank pivot table and field list will appear on a new worksheet. Select Pivot Table Fields. Once you have created a pivot table, you will need to decide which fields to add. Each field is simply a column header from the source data. In the pivot table field list, check the box for each field you want to add. In our example, we want to know the total amount sold by each salesperson, so we will check the salesperson and order amount fields. The selected fields will be added to one of the four areas below. In our example, the salesperson field has been added to the rows area, while order amount has been added to values. Alternatively, you can drag and drop fields directly into the desired area. The pivot table will calculate and summarize the selected fields. In our example, the pivot table shows the amount sold by each salesperson. Thank you for watching.